Hello, I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily download Streams R Us to your Amazon Fire TV or Fire Stick. Streams R Us comes with your Gears TV service. Gears TV has hundreds of channels available. It's a great way to cut the cord and eliminate your high cable bills. Streams R Us comes with that service. If you do not have Gears TV, simply go to GearsLiveTV.com. I'll put it in the description below the video. You can obtain your username and password there. And in this video, I'll show you how to download the Streams R Us application directly to your Amazon Fire TV or Fire Stick without the need of Kodi. Usually, if you're able to download an app directly, it works a lot better because Kodi is somewhat demanding, whereas the application itself can run on its own. So the first thing we're going to do is go to Settings, click to the right, in the navigation up top and go to device then click on developer options and turn on apps from unknown so sources then you can just click your your home button on your remote it'll bring you back to the home screen and then we're going to go to the left click left of the home button in the navigation up top that is the search area if you have your voice remote simply hold down the voice search and say downloader or you can just go down and type in the first few letters D O W and you should see it come up in the list below click on downloader and then you'll see the downloader app it's the orange app that says downloader click on that and you'll see it'll come up where it says download you own it click on download you own it and it will immediately begin downloading and installing the downloader application. Once it says open, click on open. You'll see a pop-up. It's a little bit different from Amazon Fire TV to Fire Stick, but if you do see a pop-up asking to access the files it needs, of course, allow it. And then you would click on OK once you see the quick start guide on the downloader application. You'll then click on where it says enter the URL and it'll open up your keyboard and we're going to type in targetcreates.com S-A-P-K. So we're going to type in target, T-A-R, G-E-T, then creates, C-R-E-A-T-S. C-R-E-A-T-E-S dot com and then forward slash you'll click on the special characters here to access your forward slash and then you'll go back to that area where it says ABC it'll bring back up your letters and you'll type in S a P K then you'll go to click on go you'll see the JavaScript disabled pop-up just click OK and then we're going to choose this middle option here that says streams are us APK just click on that and it'll begin the download process once it's complete You'll see the stream, the page that says, do you want to install this application? Click on install in the bottom right hand corner. And that's it. Streams of Us is now downloaded to your Amazon Fire TV or Fire Stick. Once it's completed, I like to remove the file from the downloader app just so that there, it doesn't get built up with too many files. So what I first do is click done in the bottom right and since we've already utilized the file just click delete and then delete again and it'll remove the file from the downloader app then click to the left to get to the navigation area click on home and then click back two times and it'll remove you from the application once that is complete you can just hit home to bring you back to the main home page of your fire tv or fire stick 
Now, the way I like to access Streams R Us through your Fire TV or Fire Stick, instead of clicking here on the home screen, you know, you'll see it most likely if you've opened it up already, it'll be in the recent area. Instead of doing it that way, I suggest going through settings and I'll show you why. So go back to settings by clicking to the right and then click on applications and then manage installed applications. Once you do that, you'll see all of the applications that have been downloaded onto your Fire TV or Fire Stick in alphabetical order. And if you click down, you'll see Streams R Us. Click on the Streams R Us. And the way I open it each time is I click Force Stop, then Clear Cache, and then Launch Application. If you do that each time, you're going to open the application it does a process where it it's like a maintenance process where it cleans it out so the application can run smooth and uh, doesn't cause any issues. Once you click on it for the first time, you will see the allow or deny, asking it to access the files it needs. Of course, click allow. And then it'll ask you for your username and password. Just click on username. The keyboard will open up. Type in your username. Click next. It'll pop up with password, click next again, and it'll bring you right into the application. Your Streams R Us username and password should be the same as your Gears TV username and password. And again, to access your Gears TV login info, just simply go to gearslivetv.com. You can uh, get the service from there. They'll send you an email with your username and password. Type it in and type in the same username and password here for Streams of Us and you're ready to go. Hope this helps. Enjoy.